Good evening, fellow Toastmasters. My name is George, and especially to Zachary, thank you for your powerful speech. First, I'd like to say that I love your speech very much, that I made this heart just for you. Wow. <laughs> you should be worried. <laughs> so, what do I love about your speech? First, you start off with a question. Has anyone ever felt hopeless or helpless? This piques the interest of the audience. You ask them a question, it gets them thinking so they can start absorbing your speech right from the start. Second thing I like about your speech is that you achieve the project objective of using no notes. But without notes, unlike me, you can do your gestures and your eye contact very well. You also have a very loud, very clear voice and very enunciated English, which gets your message clear, crystal clear. And you also you use your personal stories in your speech. You talk about your childhood story, how you started out in Malaysia and went to Singapore for primary school education, and how you were meeting insurmountable and intimidating mountains in your primary school journey. And also about your grandpa, how he encouraged you. How he said, you don't have to worry. You just cannot do it yet. And how in university you coached youths at, youths at, ri at risk and how you coached MK to ace his interview at the end. World champion Darren Tay once said, facts tell, stories sell. So ad adding personal stories to your speech really sells your message here. So, I love your speech, but what could make us love it more? First, you can add pauses to your speech. At your conclusion, you said you can change your attitude to be a better influence. I feel that that was maybe a tad bit too fast. You can do it. You can change your attitude so that it can be a better influence. That pause adds the punch, adds the impact that you need to make it a very powerful speech. Second thing I want to say is, maybe you can change your title of the speech. Instead of power of yet, you can change it to <coughs> that one quote that you want to say throughout your speech. It's like a song. I want it that way. You remember the title. So you want people to remember the speech title. So you can change it to, you just cannot do it yet. That will be so much more memorable. So in conclusion, Zachary, you are a, your speech was refulgent, poisoned, and cogent. Wow. And I loved it very much. And with an added two tips to add pauses and to change the title to a better one, you can make it from the ace of hearts to the ace of spades. Wow. An even <laughs> better speech. Thank you very much. Thank you.